Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Ali, founder of Neat Pages PH. In today's video, I'm walking you through how I plan and manage my content using Notion, from content ideas to posting schedules and even tracking performance. Whether you're a content creator, a small business owner, or just want to stay more organized online, this system might just be the game changer you need. So let's dive in. So welcome to my social media dashboard. Here at the very top are my social media platforms. So I have one for Instagram, TikTok, FB group, and YouTube channel. So I also have a, an overview of my total number of followers for each platform and the total number of posts for each so far. So I am primarily focusing on my Instagram account and slowly exploring other platforms such as TikTok and YouTube. I've also created a quarter audit template for each channel. So here I set my quarter goals and strategy um, for each um, social media channel. Then I track my KPI, such as my number of followers, new followers, engagement, leads, and sales. I always set my quarter goals for each KPI, and then at the end of each month, I track my progress and adjust my strategy as needed. Okay, so I've also created my weekly content inspiration and my weekly content goals. So for each week, my target includes uh, three stories, three reels, two carousel posts, and one YouTube post. Okay, so the last section is where I actually plan and organize my content. So, in this first part is where I bring down content ideas per category such as Instagram story, Reels or TikTok, YouTube, and carousel posts. And then at the start of each week, here, I just organize and schedule my content. So, for example, from this checklist, I need three stories this week. So... I just drop this drag and drop usually I post stories MWF like that and then when I click this one I'll just update the channel and the type and then I've already prepared a template per content type and then when I'm done scheduling the stories I'll just check this one and then I'll repeat the process on the different content type So I have a different template for per content type. So for reels, I also add um, my B-roll planner here. So once I'm done planning my content for the week, I just switch to my weekly board view. So each content card has a mini checklist. We have image or vid, caption, and cover design. So when everything is checked off, I just move the card from planning stage to ready to post. Okay, so this Kanban board helps me visualize where each piece of content is in the pipeline. So, on the planning stage, this is where I um, brainstorm and organize my ideas. And then for Reels or TikTok, I just move it into the to film column. And once I have the videos ready, I just move it to editing. And once everything is ready, for example, this one... I just put it into scheduled and or publish then at the end of each week all the published or scheduled contents are moved into the archive section so lastly the calendar view gives me 
a monthly overview of all my contents so it helps me stay consistent avoid content gaps and align with weekly themes like monday motivation friday reset and monthly reflection so you'll see everything from reels to carousel posts stories and youtube uploads so all are all color coded by type and tag by platform and that's how i plan my social media content using notion if you found this helpful don't forget to give this video a thumbs up subscribe for more digital planning tips and hit the bell notification so you never miss an upload if you got questions or want notion template walkthrough drop them in the comments below thanks for watching and happy planning